Hey guys, it's Pop Scrap here. Just making a quick video for you. I should have been um, doing more scrap in here, uh, bringing more scrap down, but oh, it's been very, very busy now at the minute picking stuff up, and my back garden is full of stuff, and just haven't got time to start bringing stuff down and keep processing stuff. But bringing it down is a, a bother. It's a big bag of wire. This is a two ton bag. It goes way up. It's a ton bag. But it goes up to double the size, it folds up high. And um, yeah, this is very heavy. It's all kind of cable, Romex in it, everything kind of cable in it. Um, it's good cable. A lot of money worth there on the cable, you wouldn't think so. It's a lot, a lot of processing there. I have a lot more to bring down. I have to start bringing down stuff. Bring it down bit by bit. At least I know it's safe when it's in here. Um, big bag of heavy stainless, all stainless. I have to sort out a ton bag for stainless because I have a lot of sinks I have to bring down. That's stripped. There's three sinks there stripped. And everything, my non furs this is everything that I strip. Um, all my non furs comes into the shed. So it's a big, 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 big shed. So if I come back here, it's a huge shed. I have half of the shed I have, so I have to clear all the stuff back. I have to, so I have make room so I pile it up. So very high shed, so I can pile up very pile it up very high. Um, but I have to start bringing down the stuff. I'm just, ugh. I bring it down the most valuable stuff I am at the minute. But I have batteries, I have a lot of aluminium, I have more brass and stuff. So I just go through here, look, big big container full. But that's a kilo and a half alone, guys. This is thick copper. That's a kilo and a half here alone in that in that wire. And this is about thirty kilo bucket. It's the same, this is good stripped copper wire, full to the neck, stand it on it, press down. I have a lot of stuff, I have copper tanks to bring down. In here we have all brass taps, there's usually 20 kilos here. Heavy, heavy bucket, another little, it's about to hear alone in um, plugs, brass plugs. That's very heavy weight, this is very heavy, pure, pure brass. That's very heavy bucket. Another bucket of brass. Can't move these of lead. So I'm starting to bring all down the stuff. There's a lot of money worth of stuff there alone. But well, I'm getting it down bit by bit. Um, brass one here, or stainless steel. Good weight in that. It's heavy stainless. I think you've seen that already. I have to start bringing down my aluminium in the trailer. Because I've set a bag, a ton bag up for stainless steel. Maybe here. Or somewhere like that. Or I don't know how I'm going to sort this out, but... I'll put, maybe put a bag here for stainless because I have a lot of the sinks and I'll pour that into it here maybe. Uh, yeah, I'll do something like that and I'll clear out this area a bit more for more buckets and on first. I keep piling it up guys because it's starting to come in quick for me. Um, this ton bag, it's, it's, these are very handy for storing wire just in because when I put it into the trailer, I'll be carting it out in little bags, putting it into the trailer. Because this would be too heavy to move out of the shed at one go. So it was handy to store it here like this. The wire doesn't take up much room. So I'm just, oh, why I'm storing everything here in the shed, guys, is for scrap prices to go through the way they were um, a year ago. Right, Basically, I was getting €7 Euros a kilo for copper. Um, or even maybe hold on to it for a couple of years. Maybe I can get €10 Euros a kilo for copper. Brass was €4.50 Euros 50 a kilo. So maybe I get six euros a kilo for brass. When it, I'm just, look at this stuff I'm not. I don't need to put to, to cash out. This is how can I say it? my little honey, my little honey hole. Um, if I ever need a cash in a big way, very fast. It's an easy way to get money for it. But why I keep it here is for this has to be all cleared out. This kind of stuff here, and open up this area right for tum bags. But why I hold this here is just a honey hole for me, just for. This corner here alone, I have a lot more stuff to bring down. This will be all full now next week of all containers full of brass, copper and stuff like that. So this is just for money, just to, you know, like just a little honey hole if I ever need money for it to buy anything for myself, like metal detector or anything like that. So yeah, I start bringing it all down, clean out the garden. I'm cutting timber like hell, cutting the pallets up, the timber pallets for firewood. So I haven't done any metal detecting lately, just haven't got time with all the stuff coming in, scrap and... But when the winter comes, I'll get doing the bit of detecting. So, yeah, it's enough for ranting on, guys. It's a quick little view of this again out the minute. So, yeah, it's adding up nice. But I can get more of that copper wire. Oh, 
amazing stuff. So like, comment, subscribe, guys. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.